All right, so I'm a little bit disappointed. I just did this video live. Um, I used my new streaming program and come to find out my microphone wasn't on. I had turned it off while I had the pre screen up saying that the stream was starting soon and uh, forgot to turn it back on. So everything I just did had no sound whatsoever. So let's try this again. Short and sweet. Um, this is the July SHTF unboxing. Um, this is the Pro Box. Um, I did get it in the mail. Well, it came to the post office last Friday. Okay, then. Um, and uh, got the notification Saturday on my way into work and was going to pick it up, but then remembered that the post office closes at like noon. And it's just been seeing my car for the last few days uh, with me working and stuff. Um, I got a new setup. I have a new desk. Um, so I put that together Wednesday with the intent of doing this video on Thursday on my day off. But uh, yeah. Anyway, it is what it is. Um, here's the card for the box. I had somebody suggest last month I take a picture of it because I had done my unboxing before they did and they had the Elite box and this won't focus. Stop focusing on Freddie's face. So if you can, there it goes. If you can read that, you've got the primary box, the pro box, the Elite box. And the website, shtfsurvival.com, if you'd like to get one yourself. So, we have a guide for knot tying. That's $7.99. Um, we have a multifunction utensil, which is not on the list. Um, I don't know where it came from. I don't know why it's not in the list. Because, um, yeah, I don't know. Anyway... It's a metal spork with a whistle on the bottom. Um, it also has a small knife, bottle opener. These serrations aren't sharp at all, and I'm not sure what this is used for. Maybe you could use it as a bottle opener, pry stuff open. I don't know. So I don't have a price on that. It just seems to be an accident or an extra. I'm not sure. So yeah, uh, we have some 50 foot of paracord, but it's not called 550 cord. Um, it's nylon, it seems really, really cheap. It's kind of flat. Um, I don't know, it just sucks. Doesn't seem like $5 worth. You could get that at Walmart, probably better quality. Um, so yeah. Here we have a Versatule carabiner, uh, $6.99. Oh, I didn't notice those last time. It's got a little teeny tiny Phillips screwdriver. I guess that's supposed to be a little, that's not really sharp, so that's a little flathead. That's pretty sharp. Little serrations at the bottom. So yeah, that's kind of cool. Nice and heavy. Um, in here we have a little flashlight. It's a little LED lamp, four ninety nine. It doesn't have the batteries in it. It comes with. Uh, it's supposed to cut, go put three triple A's in there, but it's got this little rounded dome type light, similar to what my headlights are on my Fiat. I'm going to guess it spreads the light out. It creates a little lantern. You could probably hang in a tent or something. All right, let's see what else we got here. Now this, I was confused by last time I opened it. Um... It says it's an emergency tourniquet carrier pouch for $25, but there's no emergency tourniquet kit. 
Um, this seems kind of weird for $25. I don't know exactly what you do with it. Um, so yeah, that's a mystery to me. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense. That was supposed to be one of the Pro Box items. Um, I don't know. Seems a bit of a dud to me. All right, we have just a couple items left. This, however, this is supposed to be thirty dollars. Um, it's got a USB box, and there's a cord that I dropped on the floor. Uh, this is the multifunction work light. A little kickstand. These are rubberized, all these corners and oh, and it's got a handle. That's cool. I didn't open it like that one all the way. It's got your micro USB charging port. It has a USB port too. I don't know if it's capable of charging other things or what, because there's no like booklet. But anyway, here are the different lighting options. It's got high, low, uh, red emergency triangle, flashing triangle, and then off. Um, when we were stationed in Germany, uh, you had to get your car inspected, just like you do in many other states here. Um, we don't in Arkansas. I know that you do in Missouri. Um, but two of the requirements in order for your car to pass inspection over there was a first aid kit and um, a warning triangle or triangles. I think it was a set of two that came in a little box uh, that you had to set behind your car if you were had a flat tire or, uh, you know, you were on the side of the road. I've seen more people use them now and they're a little bit more readily available, but when we first came back to the States, um, it wasn't the norm thing for people to have in their car. So um, I kept one of ours. I think before, when we sold the bug, I had one still in there. And last but not least, we have this knife. It is a survival Tonto knife. My Colombian survival. Um, what I when you open it, you've got three colors. It's paracord, black, blue, and green. Um, and then you've got a wrap guide if you don't know how to use it, because the blade is basically just like a blank. Like when you make a knife. So you just wrap, you're going to wrap this part with the paracord. Um, as I've said on other streams, Jason has made um, keychains and uh, a rifle crossbody carrier sling before, so he can probably do that. And I'll, if he gets a chance or gets around to it, I'll show you guys next video. All right, so that's all that's in this box this month. Again, apologize, it's a little bit late. Um, but yeah, the Pro Box retail value is at $119. It is $49.99 a month. The regular primary box is only $19.99 a month. The retail value this month is $64.94. And that comes with everything I have here, except for the weird carrier pouch um, and that cool emergency light. And I still don't know where this spork thing came from. <laughs> but whatever. Um, anyway, yeah, you heard my alarm go off while I was doing that. That means I need to get ready for work. I should be walking out the door in about 20 minutes. So, but I wanted to get this up before it got any later than it already has. Um, 
Hey, CJ. <laughs> yeah. Um, thanks for coming to the end of my live video. I'm glad you didn't show up for the crappy one that I just deleted because <laughs> I didn't have any audio on accident. So you might want to go back and watch the rest of this and see what was all in the box. I'm getting a little bit closer and closer to 500 subscribers. Very slow going. I know I'm not like, I'm like a teeny tiny ant on YouTube compared to, you know, lots of other people. But I keep plugging along, even though it's been a couple years. Um, I think the next thing I'm going to do on this channel, major wise, um, I'm redoing the living room again. As you can see, I changed the paint color to uh, off white instead of gray. Um, I'm going to try to fix the stream issue again, like I said, so I can play WoW. Um, that's not till the end of August. I don't know what I'm doing between now and then. Um, my apple trees are still growing. I tried my hand at some tomato plants, and those are growing. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to finish this accent wall. Um, it only goes to about here. <laughs> Just enough so that in this shot it looks like it's completed because, you know. Um, Oh, we are planning to go to the beach. Uh, we leave here on the 13th. Uh, that's for Laura's birthday. Um, I might try to do some vlogging from there. It's too bad I can't live stream from there. You can't go live on your phone like you can on Facebook, um, which freaking sucks. But anyway, I hope everybody has a great day. Um, I'm going to go get ready for work and uh, get that pizza out there for those hungry people. Um, so thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye.